Very good morning ladies and gentlemen. We welcome you to the 4th Texla International E-Conference on Global Education Research and Technology for Sustainable Development hosted by the Texla American University. My dear friends, colleagues, whosoever sitting and attending this particular conference, just like to share that what we have done in the past 3 international conferences which we have done successfully and across the globe and sharing our thoughts innovations and ideas throughout the world and much more people have been benefited by those things which we have published through the research papers through the articles and the attendees presenters who have presented their papers on to that in continuation to this definitely today is the need of like a sustainable development when we talk about the sustainable development that development that meets the need of the present meeting the need of the present doesn't means that you need to compromise the ability of the future generation so what is the need of the present the need of the present is you learn while you earn first second when we talk about we talk about learn from any part of the world learn as per your convenience and if you see these three things cannot be possible if you are having an enhanced technology to deliver your services to the people across the globe texel american university do this with the help of not only through the various modes of programs but also with the help of this beautiful e conferences which we conduct year by year and successfully increasing the participants regularly you will be glad to know that this particular e conference has an international recognition and once this conferences will get over you will definitely get an ample of material to read out the kinds of research paper what we have selected for this particular e conference the kind of participants who are going to present their papers on this particular e conference definitely boost your knowledge and when the knowledge boosting is there definitely the career boosting is always there and another point which is related to the sustainable development that it involves human intelligence decision making now this is a very key part that what do we understand by the human intelligence decision making when we talk about the human intelligence decision making that means that you are developing not only your skills in terms of knowledge but also in terms of analytical knowledge see there is a word which i have added in between this that is the word analytical when you will be able to analyze you will only be able to analyze when you definitely go in depth of each and everything which is in front of you simply reading the books cannot make the sense those who have written the books they are not the god but yes those who are writing doing the research on the continuous basis they are the people who really gives you the new things new ideas new updates to enhance your knowledge once your knowledge is getting enhanced definitely your intelligence is getting enhanced when your intelligence is getting enhanced your analytical skills are getting enhanced enhanced and when the your analytical skills enhances it develops the leaders and this is what the texela believe into to develop and to create the leaders of the next generation when we talk about the sustainable development another part which comes into the picture that is the efficiency planning and management now do you think that if you are only reading the books and sitting at your home reading those old books of 80s 90s even of 2016s or so they the technology is changing so fast everything is getting outdated on the day to day basis you need to get yourself updated and these kind of e conferences which the texla always conduct that gives an edge over the other conferences what is happening across the world while why i am saying this because it's not only a development of a human intelligence ever you have think a combination of human intelligence with the artificial intelligence nobody has done this particular comparison people talk about the human intelligence but people get confused okay if it is a human intelligence then what is an artificial intelligence when we talk about the artificial intelligence where it comes you can see the two simple words are there 
one is the artificial created one is the intelligence which is acquired through the skills when you mix both the terms then definitely your ideas are blooms like anything when the ideas blooms like anything you need to get in on to the role that yes this is an idea this has to be implemented this has to be achieved this will be my goal and this is the way i am going to achieve my this particular goal and my dear friends honestly saying when you are more indulge into the research these things will come automatically into your mind and it will become a hub of ideas over there then you have to segregate those ideas into the various priority basis putting them into the 1 2 3 4 5 go to search again and then find out which is the best way of solving this particular problem whatever is coming across in front of you every problem is having hundreds of solution which is the best solution that gives you an artificial intelligence to decide now when we talk about this particular concept again there are hundred ways to do one particular thing which is the best way who will teach you nobody will come and give you the knowledge on that particular thing you need to dig in how you can dig in you can only dig in when you go for the innovations for the ideas for a thought process from where those ideas innovations thought process will come there the research comes from where the research will come when the pool of people are accumulating at one particular place and giving their ideas thoughts innovation in form of a research articles and from there a rainbow arises which gives a complete glimpses of actually what we need to the best way of doing a particular thing one person cannot give you entire knowledge on a particular topic you need to have a good intelligent energetic diplomatic as well as very important part is the innovative people to think about that okay fine this is the problem how it has to be solved you know research is not only the things that which is coming by reading the books articles magazines and the literature reviews what previously the papers have been published it is also belongs to the group discussion it's also belongs to the brainstorming now when we talk about group discussion brainstorming you know my dear friends these brainstormings and the group discussion is the part of the conference where the intellectuals are sitting there and they do the discussion and from that discussion we de- we do a take away what is the like take away because any conference is what we are conducting if you don't have the objective that is the outcome that is the take away until unless that conference is not going to be successful at all ever you are thought of like development of human how a particular human will be developed a particular human can be developed 10% by reading the books okay fine i agree to that to another 20% i can add okay discussing with their colleagues surrounding to him it's make you 30% another 20% i can add okay fine you have done on a particular topic you have researched and done the phd program i agree let it be 50% from where the remaining of the 50% will come the remaining of the 50% will come from the pool of people who are sitting together discussing their ideas sharing their thought process giving the more ideas and innovations to your thought process and from where you take your things away and then you sit quietly and do the research again my dear friends this e conference is going to give you an ample of knowledge not only in terms of research not only in terms terms of technology enhancement not only in terms of sustainable development i can break these three words is a major con- content of the complete e conference you can break it the research how it is how it is important for you 
the technology enhancement services how it is important as on today the sustainable development of the person how it is important as on today if you club all these things it means you can say the texla american university has brought the three ingredients into one umbrella and we are organizing this fourth international e conference that is why the topic name has been given the global education research and technology for sustainable development my dear friends my best wishes to all the paper presenter who are going to present the papers all the people who are going to attend this particular e conference because definitely it is going to give you an enhanced knowledge and knowledge is the only thing which always increases the more you will distribute the more it is going to increase this is the only thing which never decreases while you distribute it so gain that particular knowledge and get yourself facilitated by this e conference and definitely we will love to have the good feedbacks the honest feedback from your side and texla promising you from this particular platform that year by year we are going to enhance the level so that we can map up to us like what the harvard and the liverpool other other world universities are doing so you do, one one thing where here i would like to just add on over here do you know who developed the case study do you know which university developed the case study the case study word has been developed by the harvard university same way when we say combination of research technology for sustainable development this is the key word which has been developed by the texla american university this is not only a sentence this is a whole set scenario which will change your thinking perception how we are going to take our future career towards the success towards the achievement of the goal once you will go through and if in, when you will attend this particular conference for the consecutive 3 days what we are holding my dear friends definitely you will be having so much in your mind and definitely the texla promises you that the next year when we will come up with our fifth international e conference you will find that those people who are today as an attendee will definitely love to present the paper in the next e conference because they will get an idea after listening to this particular e conference that how to write what to write how to think how to execute and once the execution of the ideas has been generated in the mind of any human being he can do the wonders so my best wishes to all the attendees to all the participants and once again on behalf of the texla american university i welcome you all to the fourth e international conference on global education research and technology for sustainable development have a nice day and have a nice conference thank you very much